KCRH 89.9 FM, the East Bay's best variety. Streaming live at KCRHRail.com. Midday mix up crew live and direct in the building. We got the girl mm -hmm. Ellen Perez here. I'm here. Don't mean DJ Touchy's over here. Yeah. DJ Ando <laughs> over there standing on the sideline and stuff like that. And now today, you know, you know, since we've been pumping up and everything like well, we've that. We've been waiting I'll for. Him, I'll let him introduce himself because you guys are going to be able to tell exactly who the person is. If you're not looking at the video right now, who's inside the studio right now, go ahead and introduce yourself to the people, sir. Hola, padrinos, ¿cómo están? Aquí estamos una vez más, KCRH. Here we go, What's up? Right here. What's, what's going on, y'all? So, what's going on? Chewy Gomez, legendary radio personality here in the Bay Area, across the world, stuff like that. Everybody knows who Chewy is, and if you don't know who Chewy is, you must have been sleeping under a rock for Or you're new to the Bay Area, years. something. Man, something. period. How are you, sir? Short, fat. Short, I'm fat. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of tall and fat, so, I mean, we, you know, we relate to stuff like That's that. Right. Also on the radio, stuff like that. So what, what have you been up to since, you know, your departure at your last uh, position and stuff like that? Uh, a little bit of nothing. A little bit a lot, of nothing. A lot of relaxing, That's a lot of sleeping. Uh -huh. I, I haven't hit a lot of events, though. I've been, like, almost everywhere. Like, everywhere you turn, you find me. Yeah. True. That's what's what? up. That's true. Yeah, Check my Instagram, bro. Yeah, <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. Like, if you do pay attention to his Instagram and stuff like that, you will be able to tell that. I mean, you had the high road day, all these different clubs, different lounges, different events on the weekend, stuff like that. Different radio stations you've been going to. You went over to CBS radio. Different, there's different things like that. You've been active. You haven't you haven't slowed down at all. Uh, why? Why? I mean, there's no reason you, to. You got to stay active. Be as active as not more active now because now people don't get a chance to hear you every day. Now they got to see you. Mm -hmm. So now I'm out there kissing hands, shaking babies. Yeah, definitely. Makes now, sense. One of the things <laughs> Makes that, sense. I now, feel it. One of the things that everyone, because I put it online and said, hey, what, what questions do you guys have for Chewy Gomez? And they were like, where is he going next? Like, what's next? Like, everybody wants to know what's, what's going to happen next? next. Right now, everything is in limbo. I'm kind of just enjoying my time off. Mm -hmm. I've talked to a couple of stations, had some conversations, nothing really legitimate, nothing mm -hmm. really with offers on the table. Just kind of had conversations. Y'all, I'm available. Yeah. You need somebody, holler yeah. at me. Straight uh, up. So, yo, just kind of just been having these conversations, that's all. For sure. And we, 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 we really appreciate you coming here today. You were just here a couple of weeks ago, too. You stood in for our class. You talked to us. You let us know, you know, some of the trials and tribulations of being on the radio, some of your experiences and stuff like that. Like, out of all the moments that you have within your career within radio so far, what's the highlight? The highlight? Mm -hmm. Aside from uh, Meet Nice Cube. Yeah, I remember, I remember that. Too. Oh, I remember that was like a story that was just, every time Ice Cube, Ice Cube. <laughs> but it was uh, a dope story. No, I, I think that one and, and then Stop Your Traffic on the Bridge when we did that when I was back at uh, at uh, Wild 107 with Man Cow. Now, the I have a question. If we were down to do it, Oh God! Would you come with us on the bridge and we shut it down again? Hell no, this time I meet Prince. <laughs> I thought you were going to say, hell I was like, really? You didn't learn the lesson? No, no, like, like you know, not knowing it now. Yeah, no, yeah, now. But, but back in the day when I didn't have no knowledge, I was uh -huh. like, yeah, let's go do it. Let's go stop traveling on the bridge. Because, like yeah. you said, you didn't know it was gonna be that big of a deal. I like, it's like, okay, you know what? Well, why not? Yeah. What's up, KCRH 89.9 FM, radio.com Ellen has a question for you or two or something like that. I want to give you the opportunity to say something. Open your mouth, girl. I do, girl. girl. Open your <laughs> I mean, mouth, girl. I was like, I'm coming. I said that before. But you know what? No, I actually went ahead. <laughs> Oh, wow. I really did set that one up. Anyways, I did go ahead and ask also what, you know, what questions listeners had for you. I mean, for those who don't know, how long have you actually been on the radio? On the radio, about 26, maybe 27 years. But I was at my last job at uh, 106 for 20 years. Hmm. So 20 been, years. That's a long time. Yeah, 27 years is not enough to my that. age. Yeah. What? Yeah. What? Crazy, my age. That's crazy. crazy. So you know, um, obviously you've been doing this for a while. You've been in the game for a long, long time. What do you feel has changed from radio then to radio now? Nothing. I think I think your job is still mainly to inform the folks and keep them entertained. Uh, I don't think in in that sense your job position has changed much. Just the technology that you used to to as a medium to introduce the music. Back in the day, we used records. Then right. We used carts. Then we use CDs, and now you don't have nothing. You have everything on a computer, and all you do is hit a button. The music's already there for you. Uh, so in regards to, to what's changed, probably that has changed the most in the way we share music. Right. So not not necessarily the layout or the way that, you know, you interact with your listeners or, no. you know, I mean, It's just always anything. been about you and the connection you have with your listeners. That, um, you know, for the most part, you want to definitely let them see you. You let them get, get to know you. And, uh, you know, hopefully they'll, they'll be a part of your family as well as you are a part of theirs. I like that. Straight up, man. KCRH89.9, KCRHRail.com, live and direct in the building with Chewy Gomez. 
Now, Jeez. being in radio for so long, like, how do you stay relevant? How do you stay with the times? How do you, how do you keep, keep your name moving? hot? Yeah, you stay out there. You're, you're where the people are at. Because, I mean, you know, at the end of the day, who listen to you is who are really your, 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 uh, well, I mean, they're your listeners, first and foremost, but you know, they're, they're the connection. Mm. You know, so if they're having something, whether it's a car wash or fundraiser, or you're at the, like, tonight I'm going to go see my check the kills. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. You know, that comes out in a couple of days, but I'll be able to see it tonight. Yeah. And, uh, you know, so I'm out there, you know, where the people are at, you know, so I definitely try and connect. Definitely. Now, how do you, like, I know she mentioned, like, how do you feel radio has changed and stuff like that with the, the way we get music and everything, but how do you feel, like, what, what's the competition like within the radio field? Because that's, that's what we're fighting. We're, we're, we're fighting to get to a bigger station and stuff like that. Right. And, and I, we will, but, I yeah. mean, it's a fight. It's, it's, a, it's a fight. It's, it's going to yeah. happen. And it is a competition, though, trust me. Yeah. And, 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 and nobody's trying to give up their positions either. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I mean, it's tough here in the Bay Area because, you know, you've had people like myself who worked in their position for 20 years and, you know, not really trying to give up your seat. Yeah, and, you know, if it wasn't for being fired, I probably wouldn't have gave up that seat. Definitely. You know what I'm saying? I, was I don't busy. think people would want you to have well, given up nobody that Nobody wanted seat. you to. So, you know, nobody. everybody oh, knew that was your seat. Oh, somebody wanted me to. What happened? Because <laughs> somebody wanted some me to yeah, leave that a, seat. A, a couple mm -hmm. of people right, did, right, but, right. you know, the majority of uh, the of your listeners right. throughout throughout your career, and including the majority of probably everybody inside this room, inside this station right now, we didn't want you to leave. True, true, Like, true. half of us don't even listen to the station anymore because you left. I applaud y'all for that. Yes, indeed. Woo! Yeah! Snap, snap, snap. KCRHA 9.9 so um, one of his highlights was me and Ice Cube. So we're gonna jump into some Ice Cube music right now. It was a good day on the East Bay. It's best variety. Show live at KCRHRail.com. We'll be back in a few minutes with Chewy Gomez. It's a good day. It definitely is. So make sure you guys don't go nowhere. Keep it locked in the East Bay. It's best variety. Show live at KCRHRail.com. I said that already, but you know I got nervous. So it's I okay. Say it again. Let him know. Let him know. It's all good. We are. We are <laughs> the future of radio. radio. You feel me? Just waking up. In 